Is there? According to my thing, it says there's a hidden one on the chest, but I don't see any on the chest. It must be exquisitely hidden. Maybe it can only be connected to that one. Let's see. Oh, let's go ahead and do this again. So I had the right idea, it's just I wasn't hitting in the right spot, I guess. Come on, damn it. What? I s hmm, no? Gotta scratch my eye for a second here. Maybe I can't see it from this side. Maybe I'd have to go over to the other side. Let's see. Now that's a fucking idea. Ryalder says, maybe you need to bring an emitter out of this puzzle by using the whole jump mechanic. Which is definitely possible. Quite possible, actually. You sit right there. You're not supposed to get past that. You're cheating. Stop it. Bad. We could bring both of them out. We'll see if one's enough. I guess there is one that's hidden right there. That's fucking stupid. No. There you go. Oh. So you only have to find the things that are invisible to solve that puzzle. That's good. I mean, it did tell me you had to hit it in the heart, I guess. They had to be burning, so they had to use a laser, so I guess it wasn't complete bullshit, but... Eh. And you did have to get out of that puzzle with the emitter, or the, uh, the connector, rather. Thanks to Rye Elder for fixing, figuring that one out. Alright, that's all the ones in four. Five is done. Six is done. Seven. Seven's done. We have them all. That's not the place to go. Here we go. Slap in those tetronomes. No, I need more... I need more sigils. I must have accidentally missed a place. Okay, let's do it again. This one we have them all. This one we have them all. This one? Uh-huh. Four? Yeah. Five? Yeah. Six? Doesn't have any. Seven? We got them all. Are you telling me there's some in here? Let me see. Wait, what? Zero stars. What? Uh, hmm. Let's see, it looks like a uh, tiny shopkeeper has... Oh, I was gonna say, they look like Takoyaki, but they're apparently taco meatballs. <laughs> He's posted an image into the, uh... Into the chat. Okay. Eight. I have eight. I apparently need ten. Did I not read that correctly? Yeah, ten. Okay. How many are on this? Let's see. In B, we got one, two, three, five, six, eight. So there's two more that we need, huh? Yeah, there's ones that are apparently hidden outside. Ah. That's right. That's right. There's ones in those extra levels, aren't there?
Okay. There's one in the, the central area. Okay. Huh. Okay. Well, guess what, folks? We're going to the tower. We actually found the one in the hidden world. That was the only one that was in there, apparently. I'm pretty sure that's the one I was thinking of. 28th star? Is that the one? Yeah, in the messenger world of C. That's the one where we had the, uh walk across the uh, the gap, you'll remember. Okay. So these ones we didn't find because we just didn't fucking go there. We've been completely evading the tower. Evading and avoiding, rather. And both of these are in that general direction. So let's go on and go over there. There's supposed to be a small building around here. Still looks like a space elevator to me. There we go. Yeah, there's another whole building over here. Okay, and there it is. So we'll need a connector and we'll need a blue. So where the shit are we going to get a connector? Could be anywhere out here. Some quiet beauty to this region. Is that like a little water tower up there? What is that? Hmm. Okay. Let me look closer to this area just because I have a pretty strong habit of missing things. Maybe it's in one of these other buildings, or even the tower itself. There's another one in the tower, so we might as well approach. It's over here. Ah, I need to... There's the emitter! Need to go get the axe again. Fucking axe. Okay, well that's easy enough to find. Hmm. The X was in area C, so we'll go pick that up for now. Also, it may be in my interest to look around the outsides of these. We'll do that once I get back. Really, it was the sound cue that gave away that emitter. I just heard it to my right, about There you are, you old bastard. If only the connectors would make noise. Alright. So if we run over here, we should find the axe, I think, to our right. Yep, there she is. Come here, you. This game is feeling a bit meta right now, sort of like when in, in Portal when you go beyond the walls, if you know what I rem if you remember what I mean. Most of you, I'm sure, have played Portal, but there's like those sections that are outside the level that you can sneak in and they have all sorts of things on the walls. From other test subjects. Alright, let's progress towards the tower. Again. What you have to say? This tower must be what we're. This tower. This must be the tower we were warned about. For whatever reason, my mind wasn't bringing that sentence in the view. Seems the upper upper levels are locked tight. Elohim is make is taking no chances that we stray from his path. Oh, there's more. Let's see. I'm returning from the tower. I feel a great tiredness and an enormous energy. Wait, both? Okay. What I now know disturbs me. I hope that by living with this knowledge, I might provide a shoulder for you, the giants of tomorrow. I see. And what do you have to say? The view from the top must be incredible, he questions. 
but there's more here. I was in such a rush. The voice keeps speaking to me, but I can't, hey, I can't get it out of my head. It's wrong. It's all wrong. Listen to me very carefully. I have climbed this tower, and no good has come of it. The wor this world is the only world. Elohim's will continues eternal, and the paradise is banishing all of this from your mind. Oh, who say they have made it to the top are blatantly lying, or they, or they would, or they would say what what was actually there? Yeah, that's true. Let's go ahead and break this down. There we go. I'll just set this up here. <laughs> okay, there's nothing else on the outside of this. You'd think Elohim could actually do a little better than that. Okay, now what I was going to do was look around the outside to these. Because there could be another little building with, uh, with a connector in it, right? Or there could be something I need to break. Which means I should, probably should have brought that axe. Is there something other than What you have to say? Questioning doubt, conf. <laughs> this is our config for that. Keynote speech by Sarabai. Questioning doubt. They say doubt everything, but I disagree. Doubt is useful. Is useful in small amounts, but too much of it leads to apathy and confusion. No, don't doubt everything. Question everything. That's the real trick. Doubt is just a lack of certainty. If you doubt everything, you'll doubt evolution, science, faith, morality, even reality itself. And you'll end up with nothing. Because doubt doesn't give anything back, but questions, they have answers, you see. If you question everything, you'll find that a lot of what we believe is untrue. But you might also discover that some things are indeed true. You might discover that your own beliefs are, or what your own beliefs are, you might discover. And then you'll question them again and again, eliminating the flaws, discovering the lies, until you get close to the, as close, close to the truth as you can. Questioning is a lifelong process. That's precisely what makes it so unlike doubt. Questioning engages, engages with reality, interrogating all it sees. Questioning leads to a constant assault on in on the intellectual status quo, where doubt is far more likely to lead to resigned acceptance. After all, when the possibility of truth is doubtful, excuse the pun, why not simply play along with the most convenient lie? Questioning is progress, doubt is stagnation. True enough. Him. Him. From uh, Bob Rakovsky to Alexandria Dread. Hey Alex, I agree that we need something that will keep all the modules working together. Evaluate ampersand percentages adds a final test. I, let's see, I think I have the perfect solution. It's called the Holistic Integration Manager, a fancy name for something a lot like a dungeon master in the pen and paper RPGs. We created it to help run some MMOs back in the day. That's when we first created it. Now we need something that will be able to unite procedurally uh, generated and user submitted content into a coherent whole. So the game won't become too chaotic and, and inconsistent. It's a genuine AI, somewhat limited in its ability to grow, but capable of parsing and understanding images text, audio, and even video. It takes all the information it can, interprets it, and then builds and maintains a world based upon it. It's not perfect, but we don't have a whole lot of time, you understand, and uh, it would be easy to adapt the code for our purposes. Indeed. Partition. Which partition? This one's from McLean to the entire mailing list. EL Partition. Hey folks, this is just to let you know what, for reasons of convenience and security, we've partitioned EL into two separate systems. The Talos team will be working on EL0, while the Archive team will be working on EL1. You might also notice EL2 partition, but don't worry about that, that's just the, <laughs> the operating system doing its thing. Alright, neato. 
All right, all kinds of new information. What about under you? Hey, there's a thing, Bob. What do you have to say? I wish I could reach those islands in the distance, but it seems to be impossible. What islands? Attention, player. Well, it actually does seem impossible. That's all. Maybe they're islands, I guess. Maybe you're speaking of all the islands that we've seen. Nothing down here? Well, piss. Okay. Well, maybe there's something behind this bluff. Nope. Whole lot of shit. Jack shit. How the hell are we gonna hit that? We're gonna have to have more than one connector, it looks like. Where's it even connected? Yeah. Or we're gonna have to walk, like, all the way over there. How far can we walk? Maybe the connector's out there. Towards the sun. Nope. Okay, so we're gonna need multiple connectors. At least two, it looks like. Come on up. I have no idea where they're gonna be. They could be inside those? Let's take a quick look inside. I haven't scrutinized them too much because, well, I didn't anticipate they'd have jack shit in them. Look around the sides first. Does the map have anything? No, it just tells us where stuff is. As you might expect. Did we look at you? Yeah, we did. I remember those documents. We opened you, clearly. This is where I would expect the connector to be. Nothing up there. Come on, Elohim. You have anything in storage around here? Hey, what's this? I have seen the truth. Only Elohim can save us from eternal oblivion. But what about Morrowind? Skyrim. Skyrim's far. Well, it depends. There's... It's sort of a mixed bag, really. Most people don't like... <laughs> don't like Oblivion that much. And I understand why. They have the, they have good reasons. Okay, well, it seems there's no connector in B. What about A? I hear beeping. There's beeping inside here. Have we looked at you? Uh, maybe. Let's see. Let's see if I remember this text. I don't remember this. The Great Bronze Bulls pull the carriage forward. Mighty bursts of steam issuing from their nostrils. Finally, they came to the gates at the top of the shitcock vagina penis. Here assembled were all generations of gods and demigods and the souls of mortals, steel and bronze and iron, and the memory of flesh. The uh, clouds parted far beneath, revealing the beautiful plains of Macedon, where great gleaming cities had once Shikok for dynamist. <laughs> Let's see. The dialect approach. Dialectical approach. Got some Latin there, a caption. But interestingly, interesting. As such perspectives of decline and the ultimate dissolution of the Roman Empire may be, they ultimately put too much emphasis on the individual catastrophic catastrophes, or <laughs> catastrophic events, either way. Have we read this before? May we have. The real question that must be asked is why the Roman Empire, which had dealt with so many threats and ca catastrophes in the over the years, was so incapable of responding to later pro problems. We must investigate the division of wealth, the structure of the government, and the location of power in the Roman society. Had the Republic survived or been restored, would Rome still have fallen? What was the role of the debt of what was the role of debt and slavery in creating the conditions for what we call now the Dark Ages? Rome, the saying goes, was not built in a day. 
but didn't phone a day either. To register for the class, please email a bunch of ampersands. Oblivion was good for its time, says the chat. A totem fucks agrees with biodissonance over, over that, uh, that little thought. Which is true. Certainly had some things going for it over Morrowind. I think whenever you fired an arrow at people, it didn't have you didn't have to aim twice essentially. You didn't have to hit people and have the actual RNG hit people. <laughs> Things still bothers me. Is there I thought that was a wall over there. Oh, there doesn't appear to be any connector in here. That's one thing that bothers me with Morrowind. You can take an air, you can take your bow and arrow, shoot a guy right in the chest, and somehow miss. It's all like, what the fuck? Okay, we've read that. See, do you have anything hidden within you? you oh, you have this. What do we got here? I wonder what's down there. I don't, I don't know who to trust. I'm afraid to go on. We don't see too many of you, Didymus. Really, it's like, shh, oh, here's a bunch of stuff. Let's see, the last land before I conquer this world. Before I have conquered this world. This is from Samurite. We haven't really seen a whole lot of him either. I assumed you're can. I'd see, I assume you're counting the hidden islands, says always right. I hate you. Don't hate, just, just figure it out, scrub. It's not that hard. Hmm. Ooh, all kinds of hidden stuff over here. What are you hiding? More bad rec replicas of forgotten worlds, says Dog. Someone we have heard of <laughs> a lot from. He can't wait, sarcastically. Shakok Vagina Penis took the world's words right out of my mouth. Did he? Oh, this guy. There must be something deeper, more profound than what I am. Something great. I must tear at it, shred this fake world, to find the truth, to find myself. We've made this bar. We, you only need the red ones to climb the tower. And these are the last of them. The reds are alive. Green is the color of eternal life. I suppose it kind of is. Well, I suppose there's no putting it off any longer. There's nothing down here, as far as I can tell. Who names their kid that? <laughs> Shitcock vagina penis. Maybe they never wanted kids. You're coming with me. May need you. Hmm. Multiple floors. Huh? Well, let's go to floor one. I can't find you. Where are you, monkey? This is a puzzle game, not hide and seek. I'm in the uh, the bathroom, the little robot's room. Ha! That ooh. sphinx. Is there anything that we associate more closely with intelligence than curiosity? Every intelligent species on Earth is attracted by the unknown. Our mythologies are full of riddles and mysteries and divine knowledge. Even the word apocalypse... Even the word apocalypse means revelation. It seems like our ancestors always imagined that even at the very end, we would... Solve one last mystery. Neat. And apparently we have even more puzzle runes. Not that I wasn't expecting more puzzle runes. What's around here? I'm going around the outside because at this point, apparently I need to check everywhere. Although there's nothing over here. So we have at least seven more puzzles. Other than the one that well, all the ones that we'll find later. Here you are. Well, we can definitely get out of here with you. Where the hell's the emitter? There's answers on that thing. Maybe I don't need this for this. Maybe I need to come back with some kind of jammer. Okay, well, we got this. How the fuck? Oh, there it is. We found one of these. That's all we really need. Now let's 